about city water. Chlorine. Chlorine is the greatest crippler and killer in the modern times. It is a, a very dangerous poison. Chlorization of the city drinking water is the major cause of hardening of arteries, heart disease, stroke, and other degeneration disease. Drinking tap water so drinking tap water that is chlorinated is hazardous to your health, deadly to your health. Simply, you know, this is one of the worst things we can do. And this is what the uh, city does. They also put in other types of um, things in the water that causes um, problems and long term. So healthy water for a long term, you need clean water. Do you trust the city tap water? I can't believe, look at the problems down there. These are the list of things, like for example the City of Ottawa website, this is what they actually put inside, aluminum, chlorine, you know, we have uh, sodium, we've got uh, hydroxide, ammonium, carbon dioxide, sodium, chloramine, and each of these chemicals could kill you in strong concentrated, just a thought. This is what they have to say about water. They um, they have the nerve to mention the word purified after dumping all this in your water. On an ordinary day, human being lose about two liters of water through breathing, perspiring, and so on. Uh, it's important to replace the loss of fluids in our body with safe water. Uh, though you know, we also try to make sure we have water that's clean, uh, trans. You know, that doesn't have diseases like typhoid. Uh, you know. Uh, diphtheria and cholera and intestinal disease you know you know we looked at it has it has decreased 98 percent in Canada for the last 50 years our water needs to be purified and treated before drinking drinking benefits the benefits of drinking water it helps us to look better keeps us our weight in check you know it keeps our skin from being dull, lubricates all the joints, uh, it regulates our body temperature, assists the kidney in eliminating harmful salt and waste, carries nutrition and oxygen to all the cells in our body. It's essential for maintaining good health. The average adult needs uh, six to eight glasses of water per day for digestion, perspiration, breathing, eliminating waste. It also decreases the risk of colon cancer by 45%, breast cancer by 79%, bladder cancer by 50%, rectal cancer by 38%, back in the joint uh, pain, kidney stones, urine tract infection, uh, migraine headaches, obesity, and um, it, which is kind of interesting that the body is made up of so much percent of water, we need it. To cure, purify and clean the body every day. What does not count towards water intake? Uh, drinking, um, you know, uh, nutrition like milk, juices, shoots, uh, sh sugar, sweetener drinks, salty tomato paste, juice, all takes water from the body. It, it dehydrates the body. Like tea, coffee, coke, alcohol, all these things causes problem because it dehydrates the body and the body needs to be hydrated. It is not running to sickness and disease. What happens if we don't get enough lack of water? Uh, number one trigger, daytime fatigue. If the amount of water in the body is reduced by 1%, you very uh, well, you know, you feel thirsty, your, your metabolic system shows 3%, um, 3% whereas in your metabolic system slows down, 3% can trigger fuzziness, short-term memory, Trouble with basic math, difficulties focusing on a printed page, 5% will leave you having difficult movements of the muscles or uh, thinking clearly. This reduces the ability of working 20 to 30%. A 10% loss of body water, you die. This was an article put out in the newspaper, uh, the Ottawa Citizen and the National. And basically it says federal panel ties tap water to cancer. They finally admitted after I don't know how many years of the health people telling them it is linked to causing cancer. They finally admitted that chlorinated water 
and now they, they show evidence that the um, CBP, uh, which is the chlorinated uh, byproducts, poses cancer risk to human beings. So right here is a public news that they admit it does cause cancer. Okay, so in Utah drinking water, they found these bacteria. System approved to turn in California. They, they approved system to turn wastewater into drinking water in California. California uh, Department of Health and Santa Ana Regional Water Quality Control Center signed off last week. Well, that was a while ago. They signed off on starting the purification system that will turn highly treated sewage stuff that comes in your toilet into tap water to drink. The drinking water in some parts of Ontario can have been found high traces of um, trichlorothelium, which TCE, toxic industrial solvent. Um, this provincial water quality disclosure record shows tens of thousands of people have been exposed to the compound in recent years at level considered um, risky in the United States. Uh, TCE is commonly used in um, it basically for um, degreasing metals. Exposure to high level of it associated with uh, leukemia, cancer, prostate, cervix, uh, colon, and others, it's, and others. It's dangerous to drinking water containing TCS and risk even to bathe or shower in it because of its uh, vapors. Ontario a TCS safety standard allows 10 times the amount permitted than the U.S. Their uh, deaths is of 12 children who blame on chemical in the tragedy which inspired the Hollywood movie, A Civil Action. A range of contaminants in the struggling in uh, Germany research have found up to 60 different drugs in their water samples. In their 30 state water sampling, the U.S. Uh, Geological uh, Survey has found 31 kinds of antibiotics, antibacterial chemical as, as a result, um, as of various hormones and birth control compounds. Drinking water and healthy health uh, forecasting um, pathogen risk in the Great Lakes. Dr. Rose discussed the increased difficulties of separating drinking water and sewage leading to various illness. The public health treats uh, from contact with pathogen includes um, all these dominella and you know, all these other types of um, viruses inside the water. It is eliminated. It is estimated that one third of gastrointestinal um, illness can be treated to uh, can be traced to microbes from the tap water. The water treatment uh, process adds aluminum sulfate chlorine and other chemicals to water, all are poisonous. As water passes through the distribution pipeline, it picks up poisons, the pollutants, coppers, iron, zinc, lead, which, uh, which can and does lead to serious long-term health effect. 